Okay, we're back in Axis, and I've made my OLE object, um, but I can't see the pictures, um, so that's not very good, is it? Now, I've gone to the internet, and I've looked for a car image, and I've uh, copied the image I want to use, um, and I can paste the picture in, but that's not very efficient. That doesn't look very attractive, does it? I've pasted that picture in. What we need to do is to create something for, called a form. Forms are used for viewing and inputting data into a database. So in the top here, I'm going to create a form. Now, as you could venture into making your own, which is quite difficult, let's use some magic. Let's get the form wizard to help us. I'm going to select the form wizard. It said, hey, you've only got one table. Do you want to use this one table? I'll say yes, please. And uh, I can pick them off one at a time by clicking on those or I can click on the double arrows and that selects everything. Now the ID field, as you know, is an automatic number so I don't really want to see that so I won't bring it along with me. The computer will look after it. Um, and there's some other options here but we can go straight to finish. Okay and you can see over here we've now got a form called cars and oh look there's the uh, Astra picture I just went into. Down the bottom here there's a control Forward focus says my oh there's no picture there. So I'm gonna go to my search engine. Oops. My search engine. I'm gonna go for forward focus. Exotic, aren't I? Uh, and I'm gonna choose um, this this one, that'll do. Copy image back to the database, paste it in. Hooray! Uh, now you'll notice there's a a clipping here. The picture is uh, zoomed in so it touches one of the borders. I can change that. I can um, actually if you want to change that I recommend you do have a look around. Find out how you can clip it or uh, stretch it. Um, right.